He just showed up under my car. Under my car of all cars. Yeah. Yeah. Hello, sweet pea. Good girl. Oh. <laughs> She is. She's really bad. She looks like a skeleton. Good girl. It's okay, yeah, sweetheart. You can get it now. It's okay. Come here, baby. She's really, really weak. She did come out on her own. We were able to slip a leash on her quickly. She was terrified. She just kind of went into turtle mode. We had to rush her to the vet because we really thought she had parvo. Luckily, it wasn't parvo. Their vet told us that she had been eating so much garbage. Her stomach was really suffering. In a few weeks, she should be good as new. Right, Mama? Hello. She's really weak, really, really tired. She's only about six months old. So she's a baby baby and she's scaly. But lucky you, you came to my house. She was just completely unresponsive for the first couple of days. She learned that we weren't gonna hurt her. It was really just a matter of trying to get her to come out of her shell. You ready to go out for a little bit? You ready to go out? Oh. <laughs> we took her out just to gauge where she was at. The tennis ball, she saw it and she was immediately just hooked. She wanted to play, she had that in her. From that point onwards, she was just so much better. <laughs> she really blossomed into such a spunky and funny little lanky dog. really, really made sure that she allowed herself to feel comfortable. She is a golden retriever mix. She has a temperament. She absolutely adores going on car rides. And I thought, you know what? To go to the beach, like a celebratory event of her recovery. started digging and she got an insane case of the zoomies and she was running around the beach staring out into the ocean she loved it and it was just such a monumental moment for her she worked hard to get to where she is she's a fighter